If you were to take a gander at youtube.com and search for your favorite YouTuber, you might notice this is not an actual page. This is what's known as a URL search parameter. So then what is a URL search parameter? Pretty much a URL search parameter is a way for the HTTP request to send more dynamic data so that the HTTP response can have a different page each time. Without URL search parameters, we would have nested folders. Each folder would have to have its own HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, and whatever else you have on the back end. So then, a different way to think of it is like a variable, in that if we have v equals hello, we can load in a page like this, and if we have v equals high, we can load in a page like this. So then, how do I use URL search parameters? Well, to begin, we have to understand window.location.search. So here I have just a paragraph element, and if I grab that, let's set its inner HTML to window.location.search. So now if I reload this, nothing should happen. But if I add something in here, we should get it right here. So how does this work? Well, it just grabs this, anything after the question mark. But there's not really a lot we can do with that. So we can do a new URL search parameter. with the argument of our window.location.search and if I set this to that nothing should happen aside from this nothing much will change but what we can now do is get this so whatever v is equal to will load in here and then we can do that with anything. We can do it with more than just letters. We can do that with ID. And we'll get that responding here. So that's all. I hope you learned something. Bye.